Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today we're at Brown's Camp. We have four Suzuki Samurais with us, two Geo Trackers, and one Suzuki Sidekick. Today we're going to be hitting Happy Meal and Cedar Tree. Those are not my preferred trails for Clyde because they're way too easy for me, so it kind of sucks. But uh, we'll have fun anyway. So I'll take you along, film all these other rigs. Hopefully uh, later tonight or tomorrow we will hit Firebreak 5. Well, I'm only uh, two minutes into this trip and everybody's lost. So that's a good time. But we'll get it figured out. <sighs>
Doug's a little stuck. Uh, and I just fell in the mud. His uh, winch is not working. So I'm gonna pull him out. All right, we're not really good at off-road recovery videos, but let's drag him out. That's all she took. Alright, so we're at the end of Cedar Tree and we have a casualty, not a casualty, but overheating vehicles. So we're gonna check that out. I'm sorry I didn't film a whole lot. It's hard to film and drive and it's a huge group, so it's difficult. Let's go check this rig out. Alright, so we made it through all of Cedar Tree. Now we're at the very end of Firebreak 5. Crusher's right in front of us. Everybody made it through. So now we'll go see if 
at least two of us can attempt upper crusher. Come on! All right, so it's Monday now, and I'm back home. We, uh, I didn't get any filming done yesterday. Just wanted to go out, have a good time with some friends. And well, our Sunday trip got cut a little short, and it was over before we knew it. So we just headed home. But uh, as you can tell, I brought something else home too. And we'll talk about that in the next video. Just in case you wanted to know, you can fit two trackers on a 24-foot bumper pole trailer. It might look like my truck is squatting a lot, but I'm like on a hill. But it's perfectly level, and it towed better than just one rig. So again, we'll go over this in another video. That's, you know, going to get married to this one. So anyways, um, first off, that trash pan off-road. He almost uh, fell off a cliff and died, and that was really scary. And then we ran into a bunch of trees. We had to turn around. So when I when I turned around, I ended up breaking this burr field. And then something in the steering broke. And I only had, I could only turn right. I couldn't turn left at all. So it was a struggle getting out of that trail because there's a lot of switchbacks and it was actually an unnamed trail. It must have been pretty new. I wish they would have put something at the bottom, you know, saying, hey, there's a crazy snow drift and you're probably going to fall off the cliff and there's like a ton of trees down. Well, not being able to turn left, I had to do the wrong thing and make the trail to get to the road because there's it was just going to get stuck there. Clyde would still be there right now if we didn't do that because we couldn't turn left at all. And there was a lot of big 180 left turns that were just not gonna happen. But we ended up getting them out. Took a few, took a few uh, hours, but we made it home and uh, the only trip's done. Now we're gonna start on the next project. I wanna thank you all for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave this video a like and have a good one.